Got a little bit of a treat for you here at 941. He's a Purdue professor of engineering technology with a big fan base. He creates fun science experiments on YouTube. He's got nearly 43,000 followers. So if your kids or you are looking for something fun and educational, maybe check him out today. Joining me live from West Lafayette is Professor Mark French. Professor, thanks for taking a minute out of your uh, video producing life to, to chat with us here. Tell me a little bit about how you got started. You're a big idea guy that started doing this well before the pandemic. How, how did you get how did you get going here? Well, my students originally asked me if they could videotape uh, well, lectures. And so we tried, it didn't work too well. So I heard heard about this thing called YouTube. This is 10 years ago or so. Oh man. And I started shooting videos. The very first video I got, or I, I posted, the first comment I got was from Austria. I thought, huh, well, I might be onto something here. <laughs> it just sort of grew from there. It's coming up on 400 videos now. Wow, so you're, uh, that's a lot. That's amazing yeah. in your in your queue here. Um, you're a uh, a sound guy, so can you tell me a little bit about like, is there a specific kind of experiment that you do, or does it run the whole gamut? Well, most of the videos I've got on the channel here are uh, homework problems, so it's it's meant for students. But I'm finding out there's a lot of people around the world who are not students. So you look at the the, the demographics; they're too old really to be students. <laughs> and I get lots of com comments from engineers and things. But the experiments I do are mostly uh, either experimental mechanics from my classes and or the, some of the work I do here. My, my work at Purdue is I, uh, I work on design and manufacturing of guitars. And so, so there's a couple of guitar videos and some music videos and things like the mathematics of music and how guitars work, that kind of thing. I'm going to be checking you out later, Professor. Can you tell me uh, how complicated is it? I mean, are you seeing how others are doing experiments and you want to try to improve upon it? Are you coming up with these from scratch and how uh, intricate and complicated you get? I'm looking at, a, at, a, at you at the board here and it uh -huh. is, it's frying my brain. <laughs> a lot of it is just me standing at the board. But when I do experiments and things, I, I try, to, try to do things other people haven't tried. And a lot of times they are very complicated. Um, I like to be able to turn videos around pretty fast and to show things that anybody can try. And do you, I mean, do you get help from like, dip, you know, each semester you have a different group of kids helping you or do you have like a core group now because you guys have this big following and this is something that you need to create with the same sort of cohesiveness? Well, I keep my, my students and my uh, assistants and things pretty busy. So I do the videos pretty much on my own. Oh. Well, that's cool. Do you have like a like a favorite experiment or is there one that has more uh, interest than the others? And do you have any like uh, whoops accidents that uh, <laughs> that we'll find online, too? Uh, yeah, there's there's definitely some accidents. I've fallen off a skateboard and oh. run into things. Probably the one that, that gets the most uh, 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 attention is a few years ago, some students and I made a, a gun that shoots ping pong balls supersonic. So we can shoot the ball right through the paddle. Um, oh, that's what we were looking at. I wondered. I, I saw yeah. it like slow mo, and I honestly I couldn't tell you what that was. But now that you put it in context, here it is. Yeah, there's a high speed video. I think it was like twenty or thirty thousand frames a second. So you can watch the ball go right through the paddle. It's pretty cool. You would not think that the ball, at any speed, would go through the paddle, but it shows you how much I know. <laughs> yeah, we got the ball up to Mach 1.4. After that, the ball broke in the barrel. We couldn't get the ball to go any faster. <laughs> that is so cool. Well, listen, I'm glad we had a chance to uh, to talk. I'm sure your class gets filled up more than, than a lot yeah. of others. Everybody yeah, wants to get a, get a class with you, Professor Mark French, at Purdue University. If you want to check out any of his uh, videos, see him in action, we will link you up at fox59.com. You'll get right to his YouTube channel.